This video will provide a tutorial on the step-by-step -step workflow of the Plasma Serum Cell-Free Circulating DNA Purification Mini Kit. To avoid contamination of samples from work surface and instruments used, sterilization of the area using 1% bleach, followed by wiping down with 70% ethanol, is recommended prior to starting. Additionally, preparing a biohazard bag for removal of wastes such as excess plasma serum and associated tips, tubes, and other wastes is recommended in compliance with health and safety regulations. Preheat a water bath or heat block to 60 degrees Celsius and vortex the proteinase K before use. Place 500 microliters of plasma serum sample in a 2 mil tube provided by the user. Add 30 microliters of proteinase K and mix well by vortexing for 10 seconds. Then incubate at 60 degrees Celsius for 10 minutes. After incubation, add one milliliter of binding buffer B and mix well by vortexing for 10 seconds. Transfer 750 microliters of the mixture from the previous step into a mini spin column assembled with one of the provided collection tubes. Centrifuge for 2 minutes at 3300 G or 6000 RPM. Discard the flow through and reassemble the spin column with its collection tube. Repeat this step to transfer the remaining mixture into the mini spin column. Apply 500 microliters of solution WN to the column and centrifuge for one minute at 3300 G or 6000 RPM. Discard the flow through and reassemble the spin column with its collection tube. Apply 500 microliters of wash solution A to the column and centrifuge for one minute at 3300 G or 6000 RPM. Discard the flow through and reassemble the spin column with its collection tube. Repeat this step for a total of two washes. Spin the column empty for two minutes at 13,000 G or 14,000 RPM. Discard the collection tube. Transfer the spin column to a fresh 1.7 milliliter elution tube. Apply 100 microliters of elution buffer B to the column and let stand at room temperature for two minutes. Centrifuge for one minute at 400 G or 2000 RPM, followed by two minutes at 5800 G or 8000 RPM. To the 100 microliter eluted DNA from the previous step, add 300 microliters of binding buffer B and mix well by vortexing for 10 seconds. Transfer the entire mixture from the previous step into a micro spin column assembled with one of the provided collection tubes. Centrifuge for one minute at 3300 G or 6000 RPM. Discard the flow through and reassemble the spin column with its collection tube. Apply 500 microliters of wash solution A to the column and centrifuge for one minute at 3300 G or 6000 RPM. Discard the flow through and reassemble the spin column with its collection tube. Repeat the step one more time for a total of two washes. Spin the column empty for two minutes at 13,000 G or 14,000 RPM. Discard the collection tube. Transfer the spin column to a fresh 1.7 milliliter elution tube. Apply 25 to 50 microliters of elution buffer B to the column and let stand at room temperature for two minutes. Centrifuge for one minute at 400 G or 2000 RPM, followed by two minutes at 5800 G or 8000 RPM. Plasma Serum DNA is now ready for the downstream application of your choice. Thank you for watching this tutorial. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe, and remember to follow us on all of your favorite social media platforms. See you next time!